This is a short video that will give some details to my homemade motor. It's very simple, uh, basically a wood frame. I use a dowel rod in the middle as the armature. Uh, through it is a piece of all thread onto which four round permanent magnets are mounted on either end. And they interact with an electromagnet down here in the bottom of the base. It's basically hand wound with very fine uh, insulated wire. And some of the wiring actually goes underneath the, the base of the motor. And what's very important though is turning the power on and off to the electromagnet at the proper time. And you'll notice on the armature I have two little cams glued onto place. And I'm going to turn it around here for just a second. And then on the cams you'll see that blue piece of wire which is the cam follower. So as the cams come around, they will move the cam follower and we'll turn it around again. It in turn, cam follower, pushes on a little push rod which makes and breaks a connection right here. It's a little set of points right here that open and close. And you'll notice right here, this is where I hook up the electricity from the battery. So one wire goes down through the base over to the electromagnet and the other wire from the electromagnet goes back to one side of the points and into the other connection. So as the motor turns, the points open and close at the proper time. Uh, it took a little while to get this to work. Uh, like anything, it didn't work the first time, which made it kind of more enjoyable anyway to, to work out the bugs and stuff. Uh, it'll run either direction if you switch polarity. And at one time, the magnets will pull toward each other. And if you reverse the polarity, then the next time they'll oppose each other as they come around in sequence.